What's up guys? So I'm back. I uh, decided to continue, you know, since I got the Z back. By the way, she's over there. So I decided to get back to it on the YouTube videos. Um, pretty much things I, I'm gonna do with the car, things I did with the car. Uh, but the reason why I haven't done any videos is because I didn't have the car. So, uh, <laughs> so that's why I figured I stopped on the videos. But yeah, she's happily back. Just look at that. Well, let me do a little co-star video and we'll do like a little walk around pretty much on, on her. Uh, the things that we did, the things that have changed for her, but we'll go through that right now. So yeah, pretty much just give you an idea of what changes we did to the car, things like that. Um, but yeah, the reason why I haven't had my car for a while is because again, uh, we just got finished tuning with Bartaby. Um, great guy, by the way, Juan, always. But let me show you what we did so far. So hold on. So since the last time we went, I go ahead and uh, well, since the last YouTube video, I would say, since the car was down, at that moment we had the trans balloon. Uh, we recently went twin disc, uh, clutch masters as well, 850 series, and we also got new wheels, T37 SLs, double press black. Got uh, 18 by nine and a half in the front, with 18 by 10 and a half in the rear, with 22 offset all around. So we also added the wind factory splitter, uh, J-Spec with the fins. So far I'm the only one rocking it with the J-Spec and the fins on the side. Um, thank you to Brian for installing it for me and for also doing me a custom uh, license plate hold because I needed one. I'm not trying to get give another reason why to get pulled over. But yeah, um, the car's back. We're on 91 pump gas still. Uh, we're gonna do a couple changes to her, hopefully within the next year. <laughs> but the bank account is not so happy <laughs> uh, with that at all. But yeah, 91 pump gas gang, homie. <laughs> uh, but nah, Bartaby did an amazing job. Uh, he did a couple changes to the car. Uh, we have an intake leak. Uh, nothing major, nothing that's not gonna like throw the car super out of whack, but it's still a small leak that we're definitely gonna replace that pretty soon. Um, yeah, <laughs> but I mean, from the car how it was before running with the previous tune, it's day and night difference. I learned a lot thanks to Bartaby, teach me pretty much while I was there. Um, his, his pretty much 
whole process on how everything is done it's fucking amazing totally totally worth every single penny um, all the changes he did to it makes the car run a lot 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 better um, so yeah I'm actually gonna think about doing a little um, drive around the block uh, car idles a lot better now it doesn't stall uh, when you go from a drive to complete standstill uh, the car is a little bit louder now <laughs> I idle you can hear the cams more um, because we're literally three inch all the way through uh, and plus once we open up that cutout that's a whole different story but yeah um, the plans for the car and hopefully in the soon future once money over time and all that comes comes to play we're definitely going to swap out the injectors um, for bigger injectors definitely going to swap out this manifold uh, on top of that, we're definitely going to go another 450 uh, Wabro fuel pump. Um, we had issues on that on the dyno. Uh, took a shit. Well, not necessarily took a shit, but it wasn't supplying the fuel at higher boost. Um, higher gearing. Uh, uh, well, yeah, higher boost pretty much. But uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and uh, take her for a little drive up around the block. Oh! And I'm definitely going to get this painted. I know you guys been seeing all these little holes. Uh, but before, there used to be a lot of buildup. But the homie Lulu, he's going to go ahead and do me a fucking solid. And paint. Uh, he already painted my Gandor, um, my Gandor mirrors. My veil side wing that I already have with them. Uh, he already painted them. Painted, painted them. Uh, so definitely he needs a car for a weekend. Just so he could fill in those holes. Shave it off. Repaint the hatch and have my wing <laughs> wing on and that way it'll complete the rear partial rear because i still have my carbon fiber uh mud guards and side skirts that i still need to put put into the car but yeah she came a long way right now that side looks like it's gonna rain and that side looks like all sunny and bright <laughs> but yeah we're definitely gonna go around the block um i'm gonna try to hit boost as much as I can. Uh, streets are a little bit narrow. Well, not narrow, just small. Um, and there's a sheriff next to me and a CHP station next to me. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, well, after I do that, I'm definitely gonna get rid of some of the stickers on the back. I noticed that it's not nothing against none of these brands that I have on the back or one well, of my sponsors. Um, Pretty much, this is just so I won't be as a bigger target for PD or CHP, etc. I don't mind the ones on the side, but uh, yeah, the back ones have to go. That's that's pretty much a big ass sign saying pull me over. Um, but yeah, so I'm definitely I still rock their decals on the side. No problem with that. It's just um, definitely the big ones have to go. But let's go into test drive. Oh, not test drive. I run around real quick. Let's 
is still idling perfectly fucking fine. Oh, I gotta stop cussing. <laughs> My car is always feeling amazing.
but yet we're still on 91 pump gas, which still blows my fucking mind. We're making good horses, good horsepower, good torque, and just to be on 91, I think that's a plus. So yeah, the car, she runs a lot, a lot better. But I can't really, really thank Barty B, aka Juan, <laughs> uh, enough. I'm telling you guys, if you guys need a tune, hit him up. He's gonna get your shit running right. Uh, but yeah, um, that's Giselle. She's running a lot of times better, a thousand times better. Um, Drivability wise, even better. Um, miles per gallon a lot better <laughs> but yeah and also smalls per gallon uh but yeah we can't can't wait for the many things that is going to come with giselle uh new wing uh new injectors uh, another fuel pump uh new intake manifold um what else yeah a couple more things power adders uh so we can see how she does on the 85 from what Bartaby was telling me the car really loves boost um, so we're gonna send it. I said, fuck it. We're gonna go bigger injectors, run 485 at all times, and gonna send it, see how it does. But uh, yeah, sorry guys for being literally about nine months since the last post, but I'm gonna try to do more content, um, more posts. Again, I felt like since I didn't have the car back, I felt like it was very pointless for me to post videos or talk about my car, but not having my car. But now we have her back home. Uh, just pretty much gotta button up a couple things and hopefully send it. Hopefully within the next couple months. But again, work has been just a flat rate on hours. Um, but I usually do overtime. I guess I gotta find a second, second job or something <laughs> just, to, um, just to get that income in, you know? But yeah, definitely. Uh, hopefully this Sunday you catch me and the Juice Performance team out at um, Race Wars in Fontana. We're gonna go ahead and uh, show up. Uh, mostly doing it just to hang out with the guys. We haven't been hanging out quite a while, so that's a good plus. Um, I heard of Fuel Fest, probably Saturday, maybe. I'll attend, I'm not sure, more likely not, but Sunday definitely for sure. You catch me, Giselle, the Juice Performance team, Chiquito, Raul, uh, Honor, uh, whoever um, there. We're probably going to just go ahead and cruise it there and just chill out as a team. Oh, that's going to be fun. Um, but yeah, expect more videos and then we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Alright, peace guys.